16 I think or 15 it was our final day before we travel back tomorrow uh, we're, we're traveling back by a different method we're going to take a bus because it's very difficult to find a train ticket here in Lomprapang because it's not very well organized yet but hopefully things will improve uh, but I doubt it because they're not going to change the stations to be in the city so it's not going to ever be very convenient to take the train however today we have a daily uh, a full day tour planned out we're going to get to the uh, old palace now here in Lomprapang and we're going to look around where the king used to live before he uh, was no longer the king and then we've got a well, how many stops have we got on the tour? Mm, you know, got three stops. We've got a three stop tour mm. and we're yeah. we going to Buffalo Farm, is it? Yeah. Among Village. Village and Clunksy Waterfall. Uh, we ask him to stop more. If, and we can ask him to stop more. He knows better than us, so okay. he can us. Oh, okay. He can suggest us. He'll probably suggest us to go home early so we can go home early and get same money. That would be that would be my suggestion if I was the tour guide. Right. I think we need to suggest ourselves. Sorry, what have you forgotten? Did you forget something? No, no, no. I thought I forget the, the purse, but uh, I yeah, you always forget your purse. I'm not sure why that happens. It's just coincidence. Okay, so here we are near in the main street, Sisavan Vong Road, or no, Cha, was it Cha Fangu or something? We're going to Sisavan Vong Road and uh, heading to um, towards the old palace. This old palace is where the king used to live when. Um, Laos had a monarchy, I think it was in 1975, and they ceased to have a monarchy, And uh, but this is where he used to live, or at least the king of Lompabang, I'm not sure if it's king of Laos, find out when we get there. So you'll see some of the hotels that are available here, very well built, good quality, I think it's about a million kip a night that, which is about $100. Should ask how much to come see. Ask him yeah, on his own. So we were booked for 280,000. So we're just going to compare to see what this guy wants. Two hundred. I told you you could get for two hundred. There and back, yeah. I told you you could get for two hundred yesterday when you were booking. Oh no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's okay. Tell him we've already booked, so we're just checking the price. Tell him the truth. Tell him the truth. We've already booked, but we're just trying to ask the price. Yeah. We are cheaper. <laughs> Song some birds it would be. <laughs> yeah, it's not as comfortable. We got a, we've actually got a mini bus with a drinks cabinet, which is always handy. It's 30 kilometers, so we're going to be traveling like more than 60 kilometers today so it's it's worth getting a, for an extra five quid we've got um, a mini minibus haven't we to ourselves like a luxury kind of minibus so uh, yeah it'll be better cheaper but right, here we are at the night market now this is where we ate two nights ago it's absolutely delicious um, we'll probably eat there tonight won't we we haven't got any palm for tonight, have we? No. We haven't eat, yeah, we'll eat there uh, tonight again because uh, it's the best place to eat. It's where everyone goes at night. Oh, it's very, very busy. Hundreds of people there. 
every night and the food is good it's not cheap but it's good quality eh? here's the exchange rate at the moment 11,570 11,570 kip, yeah, kip to the dollar, US dollar. So as you can see, it's quite a long walk down to the palace, so I'm going to switch off now and come back. Waterfall. Anywhere else? Among Village. Five years ago when I came here last time there was no, no, there was no car park like this apparently we've had to park here and then there's a small kind of market and food stores and drink stores and then we buy our ticket from here which is completely new you just used to pay at the entrance and the ticket entrance price includes a short electronic bus ride to the entrance I guess I'm not sure what the point is why they've done this apart from maybe get more money why, why have they changed this? why can't we just go to the entrance? Um, we just showing uh, before COVID yeah but why? how does it help? what, what benefit is it? Uh, things for sale here catapult bow and arrow well bows not arrows Crisps. I'm a ubiquitous crying baby. So I do. Okay. Nothing much worth looking at. Uh, okay, what are we doing? How much do you have to pay for the ticket? It's for me, it's for you. Exactly. I'm not paying anything, or I don't go. If it's not the same price, I don't go. So she's paying, otherwise I don't go. I don't understand why they've got two prices. Okay, next time you come to the Tower of London, it's $30, 30 pounds. You should pay 60. Yeah, I wonder how that would go down. Most of the people who live in London aren't even English.
Okay, we're at the next lagoon, uh, 180 centimetres, which means that's less than me, so I'm 193. Should we move up? Should we keep going? What's happened? Covid. See the COVID scores. Yeah. So another 800 cases of COVID in Laos. So these are just the people that actually go to the hospital. There's probably a lot more. I think before they open. Water is quite noisy, so we've got to speak a little bit louder. Okay, you've got no fire, we've got a picnic area, so no barbecues, and you've got to be careful. Not careful, you've got to be careful. Careful, you can't swim. Okay. And here you've got to be silent. Now, that is a beast of a tree. It starts here, and that's a root. It's a biggie. Quang Si. What does Si mean in Lao? <laughs> Hello, okay, okay. Okay, nothing else, no? Alright. But I don't think they come too close to this area because there's too many people, but they're in the area. Tigers and leopards and bears. Which is cool. They're probably a bit closer now because of COVID and not so many people around. Is this the main one then, Pai? Okay, so this is uh, another falls. And all this is natural, right? It's quite amazing. It's 
coming from the rainfall from the uh, mountain which is just behind here but yeah I guess it's uh, I was going to say thousands but probably millions of years of erosion has created these do not swim in this area I'm not sure why I reckon it's pretty I think it's um, shallow and slippy the most the biggest problem will be from the algae slipping over and hitting something like that tree that's right there there's quite a few people here despite the fact it's uh, now the 5th of January so uh, people are starting to go back to work go back to VNTN if we can get a ticket uh, we just got a ticket for tomorrow right so I think now we're heading to the main part the main part where basically the Kung Chi waterfall there's quite a lot of water here considering it's the dry season oh wow here it is you can see it in the background there yeah there's more water here than in other times I've been here there's a new bridge as well look a lower bridge Okay, we got a bit of noise here, background, might ruin it a little bit, but uh, we're here nonetheless. Unfortunately, they seem to be doing some work, maybe building a new bridge somewhere, or oh, for that platform. Yeah, they seem to have um, been making most of the lockdown to improve the bridges. I think the last time I came here was about 2016, so five years, and it does seem to have been improved quite a lot in terms of the infrastructure. I'm not sure if that's a good thing, because that's, most people want to come here for the natural beauty, but it does look good. Okay, we just got back to Airside, through the customs of Kung Su Water Park, Waterfall Park. And uh, we're going to get something to eat. What would you like to eat, Pai? Why don't we sit here? You want to go to that restaurant? But are you sure she's still open, though? Because it's been a few years, and the changes might have affected that she might have closed. And then we'll have no food. You want to see? Any menu? In English, it's fly larvae, I think. Gung. Prawns. No. I tried before, I tried in Thailand. And it's in Yang, boy. Sin Mu. But not me, right? Stomach. I'm um, now. This is a banana. 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 
You sure you, you want to go to that restaurant, right? Yeah, I want to see this so nice view. Is it? Okay, so Pai's decided that we're going to go to a restaurant down the road to eat. And uh, it's kind of halfway point in no man's land before we get back to our driver and he will take us to the other places on our tour. Uh, I'm not sure exactly why. Scared of the foreigners. <laughs> bye bye. You think it's open? Maybe you should talk to them. Okay, well, so this is our restaurant lunch. Our restaurant for lunch, and uh, we're the only ones here. I'm not sure what the menu is going to be like, but uh, give it a go. Sure, we're open.